Good afternoon and welcome to the prac in which we investigate the omic and non-omic properties of two elements. The two elements in question are going to be a lamp as well as a resistor. You're going to be building two separate circuits and in each case you want to investigate the relationship between the potential difference across the element and the current in the element when you have whatever that voltage is. The apparatus that you'll be using is a fixed power supply in each case, as well as a rheostat. This rheostat is simply a variable resistance and what it does is it allows you to get a varying voltage from a fixed power supply. So that's a really simple regular circuit that you'll be using. You're also going to be using these old analog instruments. This is a voltmeter and an ammeter. The reason for that is so you can become accustomed to using instruments like this, but also because it's very simple to see how they go into circuits, um, which is an important part of the exercise. The outcome of this is going to be that you'll want to be able to interpret graphically which of these two elements is the ohmic element, which is the non-ohmic. The implication of course being that if it's an ohmic element, Ohm's law applies. If it's a non-ohmic element, Ohm's law does not apply. An important part of the presentation of the result will be in the graphs that you're going to draw. In one case you'll see a straight line graph, as I've shown there. In the other case a non-linear graph. The actual shape of the graph is for you to find out and for you to interpret. Thank you.